Welcome to Carousel Digital Signage. In this video, we will go over all the basics of creating bulletins. If you're not familiar with what bulletins and zones are in Carousel, watch the navigation and vocabulary video first, then come back to this video. Let's get started. First, navigate to the zone where you want to create a new bulletin and click New Bulletin. On the left, you will see options, Templates, Uploaded, and Dynamic Bulletins. We will start with templates. Template-based bulletins are built in the Carousel user interface. To get started using a template, choose one from the list that best suits your needs. On the left you will see a preview of your bulletin. On the right you will see the blocks that you can change the content of. As you update your text, the preview will also automatically update with you. To edit the text style in your bulletin, Select the Layout tab, then select the field you want to edit. From here you can edit the font, colors, alignment, drop shadows, and more. You can also reposition the location of your blocks by clicking and dragging. Once you've made your desired edits to the template, click the Schedule tab to set when you want the bulletin to display. By default the bulletin will be set to Always Active. You can also schedule your bulletin to display on a specific day of the week or time of day. Once you've scheduled your bulletin, click on the Extras tab to find more customization settings. Set the dwell time, transition, or turn your bulletin into an alert that can override all the other bulletins in that zone. Return to previous editing sections by clicking the chevron at the top of each edit screen. When finished, click on the Publish button. The upload option allows you to create a bulletin outside of Carousel and bring it in as an image or video file. The file must be uploaded from the computer you are currently using. Uploaded bulletins will fill the entire zone with the selected file. Drag and drop your file to upload it or click Browse to select it. Once the bulletin is uploaded, move on to the Scheduling and Extras section and then Publish. Next, let's look at Dynamic Bulletins. Dynamic bulletins pull content from an outside source. Select from a variety of dynamic content sources. Let's start with an RSS bulletin. First, set the type of feed you want to use. Then choose your dynamic fields. When you're done, schedule your bulletin, set the extras, and click publish. Those are the basics of creating bulletins in Carousel Digital Signage. To learn more about Carousel Digital Signage, Check out the rest of this video series and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.